Hello my viewers and welcome back to another unboxing, viewing and testing. Another part for my new PC build, motherboard from Asus, was released on February 2023. It is a new motherboard, ROG Strix Z790 H Gaming Wi-Fi motherboard. Republic of Gamers, support 12 and 13 Gen Intel Core processor. The chipset it is the Z790, that's why in the name. DDR5 RAM, LGA1700, PCI Express 5, Asus Aura Sync with a Wi-Fi 6E. At the back, some information for the motherboard. Let's open the box and find out more about this product, install it to my new PC build and check more features about this motherboard. There are so many. I can see the box was not sealed. Let's see if the motherboard. So many things inside the box. We have instructions, manual. Oh, stickers. I like stickers. <laughs> Definitely, they will fit perfect at my new PC case. User guide. More here. For those who dare join Gamer Republic of Gamer Rock. Okay. Get ready to rock the game World with Rock Tricks. Thank you. So there it is. Now I can see ah, the motherboard inside the box we have dust. Okay. This was uh, purchased from Amazon, Amazon De. Well, let's move on. See how it looks the motherboard. If it has any problems. <laughs> Not even the motherboard was sealed. I think Asus is doing this kind of stuff, not sealing the motherboard with any security tape, just to know it is a new motherboard, no one has used this motherboard. <laughs> okay, there it is. Wow, <laughs> I can say it looks great. Gamers, <laughs> nice. <laughs> Here we have the VRM heatsink area, 16 plus 1 power stage, it's rated to 80 amp, delivery for the most powerful in 10, 13 gen processors, with an alloy socks and durable capacitors to resist extreme temperature and enabling performance, the LGA1700 socket ready for the 13 gen Intel Core and the 12, DDR5 socket maximum 7800 plus overclocking, 4 DIMMs, dual channel, Pro Cool 2 connectors are precision built to ensure flash contact with the power supply lines, 2 by 8 pin 12 volt power connectors. We have 4 M2 slots PCI Express 4 are covered with heatsink, 2 here, 1 here and another 1 here. Type it is 2242, 2260 and 2280. Remove a cushion before installation. Let's remove that. Nice. We have screws here, one here and one here. The same here, another two here, another two here. I will install my NVMe here. One PCI Express 5 with 16 expansion slot from the CPU. Another one PCI 416 slot and another PCI 3 here. Here we have four SATA 6 GB ports, one USB 3.2 Gen 1 header, supports two USB 3.2 Gen 1 port, one USB 3.2 Gen 2x2 USB Type-C front panel connector, the connection for the motherboard from the power supply, the backup battery for the BIOS here, 
here we have the ROG Supreme FX 7.1 surround sound high definition audio provides superior audio the ROG Strict motherboard features ASUS Aura technology here when I'm going to connect the motherboard we can check on that this is plastic but here we have aluminium you need a good heatsink materials for the VRM here it is the PCI Express slot quick release you can see here <laughs> I like it the other just open with your hand and unlock and lock the DDR5 has maximum 192 GB XMB3 profile and ASUS and Hazit memory profile here we have 3x3 three three pin addressable Gen 2 RGB headers and one 4 pin Aura RGB header definitely I will install some RGB lighting on my PC case here we have one Thunderbolt USB 4 header I like here the heatsink for the NVMe it looks great another chipset heatsink here and we have uh, in many areas five four pin sassy fan headers here we have the IO pump header now let's check and add the back we have the HDMI port one display port clear CMOS button BIOS flashback button two USB 2 port type A with a BIOS connection four USB 3.2 Gen 1 ports on a blue color one USB C 3.2 Gen 2 with 20 GB transfer data three USB 3.2 Gen 2 ports two type A on a red color and one USB type C these three they have 10 GB transfer data the Intel 2.5G Ethernet port two Wi-Fi 6E antenna connection optical SBDIF out port and five gold plated audio jacks and it looks great at the back all the connections and here at the back how it looks the motherboard now let's see what was included at the box we have the ASUS Wi-Fi moving antennas with a connection silicon pad it will stay very secure at any area add your PC case we have uh, two SATA 6 GB cables one it is 90 degrees angle cable ties 7 ROG keychain I like that nice <laughs> and we have uh, thermal pad for M2 not in a good condition okay one plastic cover we have uh, two m2 rubber packets and another one m2 backplate rubber packets small and two m2 backplate q lots of packets nice that was all included at the box that is one of the parts that I need to have for my new PC build more are in the way stay tuned for the next videos with the final video the PC build I like this motherboard has a good construction it feels like I have a durable motherboard it's good looking with a great design and many connections I was between this model and the E the E has many things at the motherboard I will not going to use all that and it cost more 160 euros the cost for this motherboard is 360 euros packaging was not good 
I don't know why the dust inside the box. And Asus, you need to do something about sealing your product. That is unacceptable for me to have open box. Anyone can open the box and use the motherboard, or even take something from the box. Seal the box with security tape. Customer needs to feel that is a new product without doubt. Nothing was missing. For now, the motherboard is OK. Let's see on the assembly and when I'm going to press the power button. <laughs> Until then, don't forget to subscribe, share this video, you never know who may need it, and hit the notification bell because more videos in the future are coming and you don't want to miss it. Have a nice and lovely day. Bye-bye.